Hello, this is Rakesh Rao from Design Sense Software Technologies. In this video, I am going to show you the part editing tools which are available in CAD Power. The part editing tools in CAD Power are used to edit a polyline and perform some operations on only a part of the polyline. For example, if you have a polyline like this which consists of linear as well as arc segments, you can perform a number of editing on these polylines using the part editing tools. For example, if I go to extract part of a polyline, so I pick first point of the polyline and second point and what cat power does is it extracts that segment as a separate polyline. The original polyline stays intact and the new polyline is created as an independent entity. Similarly, there is something called offset. So if I pick two points, in this case I am going to choose the arc segments and I pick a side to offset and I enter a distance as 100 and you can see that just that much of the polyline has been offsetted by 100. This is actually a great time saver because in normal situations either in BricsCAD or AutoCAD you need to make a copy of the polyline, explode it and then erase what you don't want and then do a p-edit join and then you have to move and place it where you want. So it's a time consuming operation. The part editing tools in CAD Power make it really fast. Let us look at some more options. For example, there's something called stretch. So if I want to stretch this polyline between this point and this point, CAD Power automatically extracts that part of the polyline and I can stretch it and place it somewhere here. So you can see now that since I have stretched, the polyline remains intact and just that bit which I picked has now appeared here. Similarly, let's go to mirror. So let us say I want to mirror this part. So I want, I'll pick these two points and automatically it gets mirrored and let us look at some more there's something called rotate so I just pick let's say between this point and this point and I can now rotate the polyline and place it here so all this while the original polyline stays intact and only operations like extract and offset create a new polyline in all other cases even the attached object data X data or dictionary data that is associated with the polyline stays intact. The last one I'd like to show you is reshape. So what reshape does is it allows you to pick two points and all the segments between those two points are removed and now you can place a new geometry for your polyline and click done and you can see that once again the polyline has been part edited. So part editing is a powerful productivity tool for polylines which help you do a lot of things which you would have otherwise used using a number of tools like explode, p-edit, join, erase and so on. So for the drafter who needs these kind of operations on a regular basis, the part editing tools in polyline tools of cat power help them to focus exactly on the task that they need to do rather than worry about which cat command to use. So give it a try. It's available for a 30 day trial. You can download cat power from any of the URLs that you can see at the end of this video. Thank you. Bye bye. Okay, so you've seen the part editing tools in Bricks cat. We would also like to say that the same is available in AutoCAD as well because CAD Power functions identically in AutoCAD as well. So if you go to AutoCAD also you say you see the identical menu and you can perform exactly the same operations that you just now saw in BricsCAD. 